Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspi's Hotman here. We are doing a new arrival, 2016 Panini Donruss Optic Baseball. This is break number two from the website, jazbeeshobbyman.com. You can see the next one is already in there right now. That's from a fresh case. But this is the second half of the case that we did yesterday. Big thanks to these folks for getting in on the action. Appreciate it. Optic Baseball, looking good. C couple combo teams, Braves, Marlins, Indians, Angels. We're going to randomize both of those lists eight times. Three and a five. Good luck. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. We've got Megan with the top and bottom spots. There you go, Megan. And all of the teams eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. Here we go. Dodgers on top. Phillies on the bottom. What's up, coach? Yeah, hot box. We want those hot boxes. We like hot boxes. From the case, that is. It's a family show, folks. It's a family show. All right. We've got Dodgers. Megan. Well, maybe a little Dodger Joe Mojo. Tigers going to Sean. Will, you've got the Giants. Maybe a little Oppo Joe Mojo. Could be a thing now. Seattle Mariners, Junia, Metropolitans, Ashley, White Sox, Justin P. Uh, Kenneth with the Cardinals. Orioles going to Justin P. Red Sox, Frank. Padres, TJ. Nationals, Will. Uh, Josh T with the Blue Jays. Twins with Will uh, for Bulldog fan. Royals, Mike K. Mike Koontz with that. Braves, Marlins combo going to the Ashley. Rockies going to Justin P. Ashley with the Rays. Diamondbacks, Todd. A's, Last Spot Mojo. That's Cruz. Justin P with that. Cincinnati Reds, Red Legs going to Bruce. Cubbies going to Troy. Nice one, Kisby. Yankees going to Junior. Indians and Angels going to Sean. Pirates, the coach. Astros, Jimmy Brandt. Brewers, Brad G. The coach with the Rangers and Megan with the Phillies. So there you go. That was the randomizing portion of the video for the second half of this case. Break number two from jazbeeshobbyland.com. We're going to see if there's any trades after the break, and then we'll have the break. Stick around. All right. Welcome back, everyone. Uh, there were no trades. So that list you see on the screen, it remains the same. The, like, the, like the Zeppelin song. The song remains the same. Uh, there's the official list right here. It's printed out. It's the 22nd. This is break two. It's the second half of the case. You'll note that I marked in my chicken scratch right there. Break two. And here we go. First box. Now, for those... I know this is still kind of a new product for people, so... I'll give you a look. So four cards per pack, 20 packs per box, right? Find two autos per box on average, right there, right? Now there's hot boxes too. Now someone was telling me there are like three or four hot boxes per case. I think the previous break, we already saw two, I think. So there should be two here. Look for hot boxes featuring either five autographs or 20 numbered parallels. So you'll see a lot of like parallels pop out of there. If the, and that would be considered a hot box or uh, five autographs. So, and who doesn't like a hot box, right? It's a family show, folks. We're talking about we're talking about the hobby. All right, here we go. Can't wait for those emails on that. <laughs> Dear Joe. My kid asked me what a hot box was and why Joe thought it was funny. Then I'll get in trouble. Then I'll get a talking to. Can't say things like that on air. Blah, blah, blah. It happens. It's on wax, too. I, I This is on a recording, too. So I'm, I'm, I'm pretty much busted. All right. Good luck, everybody. Pack one. Uh, CardboardConnection.com, ladies and gentlemen, has a lot of uh, information on this, including information on variations. So go to CardboardConnection.com and check it out. They also have a checklist, obviously, there. They're nice people. All right. All right, Todd. I'll see you, man. I'll see ya. Okay. <laughs>
Todd's Todd's daughters who who enjoy watching the show as well is apparently going to take over for the TG Reardon account. So uh, if Todd suddenly starts chatting like a like a teenage girl, then now you guys know why. <laughs> All right, here we go. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. Our our what? Our third break of the day. Nice. So these are pretty good looking cards right here, folks. There's Joey Votto to lead us off. Now these ones won't ship, right? These are just normal base cards, so that won't ship. That one's not going to ship. This will ship. It's an insert. There's Brendan Rodgers. That'll ship. It's rated rookie. That won't ship. That's Yasiel. That's just a base card. This will ship. Refractor will ship. This will ship. It's Billy Hamilton. Won't ship. Will not ship. But this Bryce Harper is a refractor, so it will ship. These aren't numbered, by the way. We get it now. There's Diamond Kings. Andrew McCutcheon. Some of those are parallels. It's nice Mike Trout. And that was Travis Jankowski. All right, next one. Nice Manny Machado, Nelson Cruz, Power Alley, Maeda, and Carnacion, and a two out of five. Wow, two out of five rated rookie autograph, Jared Eikhoff. Nice two out of five for the Phillies. Megan with that one. Nice. So Megan. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop, whoop! Nice one to start the day. And the Conforto rated rookie. Miguel Sano, 180 out of 199 for the Twins. That one will go to, who has Minnesota? Bulldog fan with that. Nice. I like they, they kind of gave those Diamond King cards the uh, kind of the chrome or the optichrome sort of feature there, which I like. That's nice. Good treatment on that. Byung Ho Park, another one for Will and the Twins, 35 out of 149. Byung Ho Park or Pak Byung Ho. Nice insert there. Refractor. So that's a refractor that will ship. Let me see these rated rookies will ship. And Josh Harrison, 10 out of 25. Nice low numbered autos coming out of here. 10 out of 25, Josh Harrison for the Pittsburgh Pirates. The coach, Paul Nixon, with that one. Yeah, oh, there, there's Megan in the uh, Twitch stream. She's like stealing some of Bruce's mojo. Oh, getting some of Bruce's mojo. Not stealing, getting some of Bruce's mojo. I don't know, Bruce has been crushing this week, Megan. There you go. Nice rated rookie out of five for Megan. And the coach with the Pittsburgh Pirates, nice Josh Harrison, out of 25. Not a bad start at all, folks. Second box, see, looks pretty nice, right? It's only 20 bucks a spot if you want if you uh, want to get into the next one. 20 bucks gets you a random team, and it's a fun baseball break. Oh, so Bruce is saying all of Megan's hits will get shipped to their house anyway. That's what Bruce is saying. So, so you're going to count them on the uh, on the hit counter, the hit counter at the uh, at the Bruce and Megan household. John four hundred nine looking for the Piscotti. I think. Do you guys remember? I mean, from yesterday. Maddie K, what's going on, man? I just saw you in the Twitch stream. Um, does anyone remember how many hot boxes there were yesterday? I think the first box we had was a hot box, was a 20 parallel card hot box, and then I think we saw a five auto hot box, right? Was there a third one? 
I don't think there was. I don't remember offhand. I wasn't keeping count. I was counting on someone else to do that. <laughs> One of you guys. His first spot? Well, I put his first spot in, and then I go to like spot one, and he's in there, but huh. I don't see any break. Did he tell you, and then he added it? You don't remember? I don't remember, honestly. I think, I think we're good on him, though. Okay. Well, John Con veteran noob, if you're listening, you're taken care of. This is why we double check. We, we had him, like, good in the first place. Oh, oh, because he was spot. listed later, but it wasn't a like video there. Right, it all evens out. It all evens out in the end, ladies and gentlemen. It all evens out in the end. Unless, I, unless the video wasn't uploaded or something. It all evens out in the end. All right, there's Matt Kemp at the bottom. Okay. Here we go. Hugh Darvish. Socrates Brito, who will definitely open a burrito place after his playing career is over. With a name like that, you kind of have to. There's uh, Pak Byung-ho again. 236 out of 299. Nice. Another one for Will. <laughs> Coach Paul's like, with my luck, you double check and realize he didn't have a spot. <laughs> It'd be like subtracting spots from Paul. I'm feeling that. Oh, by the way, folks, this uh, on according to the checklist, the San Diego chicken is not associated with uh, is not associated with um, any team, not the San Diego Padres. Although you would think it would be, but it's not. So in case this guy's auto comes out, it'll be randomized to one person in the break. So that's and that base card will be randomized to one person in the break too. That's your public service announcement on that. Don't say I didn't warn you. Yeah, that high tech last night was absolute fire. That Barry Sanders autograph, especially. Uh, 72 out of 199, another one for Megan. There's Jared Eikoff. I guess you're PCing him now. Nice. Miguel Sano, that wasn't flipped, uh, flipped the other way around. This autograph is presented by or guaranteed by Panini America. Miguel Sano popping out of here. There you go. Nice autograph going to Bulldog Fan and the Twinkies. Nice. Mm, Twinkies. It's Chris Bryant there. We'll ship that. And the next autograph, Kettle Marte. 13 out of 50 for the Mariners. Nice. Nice Kettle Marte, Seattle Mariners Jr. with that one. I think that should be it. Oh, nice red Jose Al or, or uh, that the other card was Jose Altuve. This is Miguel Sano, 90 out of 99, Power Alley. Another one for Will. And a Ryan Braun refractor at the end. Nice. So your two autos were for Seattle. The Kettle Marte, 13 out of 50. And the Miguel Sano for Will. Another one for Will. Not numbered, though. All right. Next box. Good luck, everybody. Ow, that kind of hurt. No, there's no, no blood yet. It caught on the underside of the box as I was. No, don't clone me. Don't clone me. There's already enough. There's already one is enough, Kisby. One is enough for me. One is enough. You don't want to have more than one of me. All 
Uh, Buckeye Gamer saying, uh, WWE is one spot left on jazbeeshobbyland.com. I'm Leap. Brandon asking, do WWE cards sell? Uh, yeah, they do, actually. Non-sports stuff tends to sell pretty well. So all that Marvel stuff and all the wrestling stuff and the UFC stuff that gets produced tends to do pretty well. A, because there's not a lot of those products out there. And, uh, and B, they're usually able to, to get like old school autos and whatnot uh, for, for various people that you generally don't see anymore, you know? Uh, Kisby asking, getting all philosophical in this optic break, would a Joe clone have the same personality? Uh, no. I don't think it would. Because a lot of a lot of ones per well, it's it's a it's a nature versus nurture argument, right? It's I guess it depends on how what you believe in, you know. Are our personalities more nature, or is it nurture? Is it both? Could be both. I'm sure it's a combination of both. I might be taller, right? The the foods that uh, people are fed today are different, so uh, so people are bigger, taller, stronger, faster, like the Daft Punk song. Could, yeah, that could be genetic. Could be genetic. All right. Now, one of me is enough, folks. One of me is enough. Todd, uh, with the Diamondbacks? No, no Diamondbacks as of yet. All right, here we go. Next box. Next box? Next box. Uh, okay. Okay. So there's the base cards. There's Jonathan Gray, Greg Bird, and Luis Severino. Is this a hot box? Auto came early. Luis Severino auto for the Yankees Jr. with that. Jose Barrios for the Twins. Another one for Will. Uh, Brandon's asking how a clone could be taller, uh, because the clone only implies that that genetically it would be I would be the same, right? The clone of me would only genetically be the same, so my genetic makeup would be would be exactly the same. However, other environmental factors could. Could uh could dictate that nutrition etc cetera, etc cetera, could uh could make me taller at some point. Massive Bumgarner one fifty seven at two ninety nine. I'm gonna hashtag this video cloning. Uh, that goes to the Giants. Will with that one. There's D Gordon, Crush Davis, and Bryce Harper. Nice MVP. So some of these have uh have these things right here. That's a nice uh. It's a nice one. Set that right there. We'll sleeve those up at the end of the break. Richie Schaefer, Diamond Kings, Diamond Kings, Rated Rookies. Chris Bryant for the Cubs, 261 out of 299 for the Cubbies and Kisby. Nice. So not a hot box, unless all the other autographs are right there. Coming to the Dodgers, maybe? Chris Archer? I'd welcome that. Because of this guy's bad back. Anthony Rizzo, another one for Kisby. 65 out of 149 for Troy. All right, there you go. There's Jose Barrios for Will and the Twins. And Luis Severino. Evan Game saying, this product is amazing, in my opinion. I think so. It looks really good, right? I like the idea of the black ink right there. That's pretty cool. All right, halfway there, folks. Three more boxes to go. Good luck, everyone. 
Wow, Coach saying evil clone Joe would ship the base and keep the hits. That's true. It'd be like Oppo Joe. It'd be like my evil twin. It'd be my evil twin. And it'd be like, no, that was Oppo Joe. And you know how like in cartoons, like the evil twin just has like different color hair or something like that. You know, they look the same, but it's just like a different t-shirt or something like that. I'd be I'd like the evil Joe would be wearing like a red, like a red uh, shirt. You know what I mean? It's like, oh, that's evil Joe. You know, like this hat that I always wear would just be a different color. It's like, oh, that's evil Joe. But you wouldn't quite know, you know, until it's too late, until all your hits are kept and uh and all and all the base is sent out i oh, watch out for that with eyes like max scherzer does he have crazy eyes you know what's crazy eyes max scherzer has crazy eyes no i've never noticed that i don't stare into max scherzer's eyes that often you know who does those crazy eyes though you've never seen a pitch if you haven't seen his eyes hunter pence has crazy you've eyes you've never seen max scherzer pitch if you haven't seen his what eyes what are you talking about like you would notice the first thing you look at him look the first thing on google max is scherzer eyes. eyes look at his left eye oh isn't that creepy uh what do they call that they have like uh when you have different two different color eyes they call that something there's like a specific name for it. Yeah, but his is like. Yeah, I guess I guess I blocked it out. I guess I blocked it out. Well, now you'll never be able to unsee it. I can't unsee it now. Yeah, I can't unsee it now. Uh, well, I might have. Uh, I don't know. You know who has crazy eyes? Uh, Hunter Pence has crazy. He has axe murder eyes. I was eyes. really proud. You Hunter didn't Pence have to is axe murder. Record murderer. a separate summertime scratcher. The whole. I know, right? You like that? Whole that must be a record. Nick, Nick is Nick just went through all the summertime scratcher videos. He says I have haven't had to do a separate summertime scratcher video this whole month. That's a record. I'm proud of myself for that. Redemption coming up. It's Michael Conforto, rated rookie, 1989 retro signatures, Carolina Blue. Wow. All right, Mets. Who has the Metropolitans? That would be Ashley Nelson. That's the color of the parallel, Carolina Blue. Yeah. I guess. That's a nice color blue. But did he go to Carolina? Maybe. Nice one. Well, I'd like to see the Carolina blue on this, Ashley. So once you, you, to, like, once you find that for us. I think they call it crazy eyes. Yeah, well, Hunter Pence has crazy eyes. Hunter Pence is an axe murderer. When, Hunter Pence is not he's actually... So cool. He he's not actually... Stuff. Hunter Pence isn't actually on the DL. Him. He's murdering people right he now in San Francisco. He's on, like, that Segway. It's so cool. Yeah, he's he's just a he's just a Northern California hipster douche. That's who he is. Kettle Marte. Hunter Pence, I've just called you out. Come to Jaspi's Hobbyland Redondo Beach. Let's talk about it and break some stuff for us. Kettle Marte, 138 out of 150. Yeah, see, even Megan agreed. Megan's a Giants fan. She's, Hunter Pence does everything crazy. Hunter Pence is he's he's nuts. Hunter Pence is Hunter, Hunter Pence is probably an axe murderer. He swings the bat like an axe. You see him like in his batting stance. He's shaking that bat around like an axe. Like it. You don't you don't just you you just don't get that stance naturally. You get that from years of axe murdering. Trevor Story. 171 out of 199. That'll go to the Rockies. Who has the rocks in this? Justin P? Yeah, Justin with that one. It's funny when they use Tops and Panini use the same photo. I know, right? Must have, like where do they like the same photographer sold it photos, to? Them? I think. Oh, Getty. Okay. They're just like, yeah, we only have one photo of Trevor Story. <laughs> yeah. That's the same as his Tops. I know. Card. It's just like uh, we didn't realize he was going to blow up this season. <laughs> That's pretty much what it means. Really took one photo yeah, it's like the, the guys are like, yeah, the but all the Panini and Tops guys were like, ah, eh, we just need one photo of Trevor they, Story, right? They, like, accidentally took it. It's like, is that you know? Troy Tulowitzki? Yeah, oh, it's like, shoot. Uh, that's, shoot, that's Trevor Story. We don't really need him, do we? And then like, whoops, Trevor Story decided to hit like 20 home runs by midseason. Six five two fifty. He's a big guy. 
I did not see the Chris Sale to Rangers rumor. There's Chris Sale right here speaking of the devil. I did not hear that. I mean, there's so many rumors going on. How, how could we ever know? Diamond Kings Manny Machado, 54 out of 99. That's nice. Red going to the O's. That would be Justin P. Who the Rangers give up for? Yeah, who the Rangers? Yeah, who would the Rangers give up for Chris Sale? I think the Dodgers are considering Profile. a move for for Chris Sale. Dodgers could do it because their thing is low. They probably loaded. have to give up like Carson well, Fulmer. And Do Fulmer. Dodgers want to get this guy too, Chris Archer maybe. I mean, why not just? No, they'll keep this guy, right? White Sox. Uh -huh. Maybe. Unless are they unless they blow, blow up the him. entire team. There it is, the famous San Diego chicken, one seventy eight out of one ninety nine. Should we do this as a lot? That's his career highlights. I mean, we'll do that as a lot. There you go. San Diego chicken spots will be as a lot. I just made that call right now, folks. If you have any complaints, jazbeeshobby at gmail dot com. We'll, I don't know, we'll refund you the however much this will go for on the eBay market. Career highlights. For the famous San Diego Chicken, which will be randomized to one person in this break at the end of the break, performed at more than 8,500 sporting events, has made more than 17,000 appearances. Wow. Has visited eight what? countries, four continents, and all 50 states. Named by the sporting users as one of the top 100 most powerful people in sports of the 20th century. That's a joke. Wow. Uh, it doesn't go to the Padres because... According to Cardboard Connection, the auto, the autograph especially, it's teamless. There's no team associated with it. So we're going by CardboardConnection.com for consistency. Because once we start making up our own checklist, then it's just a, we just go downhill from there. You know? That's all Helter Skelter. We can't do that. We go by an independent source, CardboardConnection.com. Come hell or high water. Just makes life easier for us that way. Two boxes to go. <laughs> right, coach is like he's probably only made seventeen thousand dollars from those seventeen thousand experience. I mean, how yeah, how much could it cost to, to 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 hire the San Diego? The thing is, here's the crazy thing: the San Diego Chicken is it isn't. It's like the Blue Man Group. There's probably not just one guy that's doing it. There might be one oh, main man. guy that's doing it. You're just running dreams. There's not, like, the main guy, if you want to get the main guy, like, he probably just does, like, Tommy, he probably just, mall. he probably just tend to, Santa's everywhere, obviously. He goes every mall. He's, he's everywhere, you obviously. Tell me chicken no, doesn't Santa have Claus. the same powers? So, no, he probably has blue, he's, he's probably like the blue man group. I'd like to see San Diego uh, chicken. TJ, let us know that. How, how much does he charge? Because I want to get him to Jaspie's Hobbyland. You get him to Jaspie's Hobbyland. I saw him at some other store. San Diego. San Diego Chicken versus Santa Claus. Who wins? San Diego Chicken versus Santa Claus? What about San Diego Chicken versus the Wally Monster? What? You know, the, the big green Wally Monster? The what? Red Sox mascot? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wally? Yeah. And the San Diego Chicken in a, in a, in a versus, fight? Yeah. Wait, he charges five figures for an appearance? Four figures? Come on, man. That's, ri that's, like that's that. ridiculous. What if I... Why don't I just buy my own suit? What do I get for five figures? Yeah, I mean, does he, like, better be crapping out golden eggs for me. Yeah, w Wally versus the chicken. Yeah, Wally the green monster versus the San Diego chicken. Philly Fanatic is the best mascot. Everyone knows that. Philly Fanatic's pretty good. He's the best. Philly player. Fanatic's pretty good. I mean, you know, for teams that need mascots to get them to ball the ballpark, yeah. Do Dodgers don't have a problem getting people to the ballpark. But for teams that struggle to get people to struggle. people, yeah. When's the last time they sold out a game? I this season, sell, I think they sell. They probably do a actually. lot. Of, Phillies are like they the top do, five market. What are you talking about? They probably do. Same with Boston. They have no trouble. I'll bet you an Aaron. No, I'll, I'll bet. Sold out every game since oh, like they have a tiny game. ballpark though. That's true. Uh, Dodgers could use that guy. I'll they're, bet. Uh, they're no fun team. <laughs> <laughs> Angels have the rally monkey. Don is drawing a squad. Oh, so so it's a whole production for the San Diego Chicken. He's in town for two days, does media the day before, the game the next day. But what if it wasn't for like a game? What about a store appearance? What about a store appearance? See, we like just, like, we, like a we non a non sporting event. We just need a Panini to hook us up. I know. Panini sponsorship. Hey, Panini, 
bring the San Diego chicken to like the national or to like the next Panini event or something our like store. that. Bring, bring to our store, Jaspi's Hobbyland. Ad, no, the address is not above my head anymore. Redondo Beach, California. Look it up. Google it. We're there on Google. All right, next box. This, this break has gone off the rails what already. What stops Porzingis did Sean Pitzel hit? Uh, the, the orange, the piece of the orange jersey, and then the autograph, that one. Oh, what's that? Uh, Nor. 32 out of 35, oh. Dariel Alvarez. There he is. Blue auto going out to the O's. Cruz with that one. I think Noir would be tough to get graded. That's just my opinion. I think so. Well, we we just talked about that because of the and and the black. You can like if there's just even a smaller smallest of like oh, scratch on the edge, like it shows up so much more clearly. So it's a tough one to grade. Big Boppy, there he is. Speaking of the Red Sox, one forty-three out of one forty-nine. Remember that old uh, Sports Center commercial where he was just trying, on, he was breaking in a Yankees hat. No, no, you don't remember that. The, there was a great commercial. Do you guys remember this? The ESPN commercial, a uh, Sports Center commercial, where Big Poppy is sitting in like a in like a meeting room at ESPN, and uh, a an, an ESPN anchor had like a had like a Yankees hat on it, and and Big Poppy's like, hey, that's not how you break in a hat. Here's how you do it. Give it to me. And he gets the hat, really breaks it in, kind of breaking in the brim and everything. And then Wally the Green Monster walks by. Oh, I remember that one. And, and then just and just like just drops like, a stack of papers and just looks at him and, and just ends. goes. <laughs> and Big Poppy's like, wait, no, no, no. And then it ends. I like like this is Sports Center. One, where they're like stunned, oh. stunned that he, like when he fills it up. Like, I think that's like Stuart Scott. That's I think, I think one of his last ones, yeah. That, that was a like, fantastic one. Wait till you guys see that this is Jaspie's commercials. Had that Arnold Palmer. What if we got Arnold Palmer? Oh, I kind of want an Arnold Palmer right now. I'll give twenty dollars of break credit right now to someone who brings me an Arnold Palmer, right to the store. 006 out of one ninety nine. Noah Syndergaard, four for the Metropolitans. Ashley with that. I don't want to break this this break has gone off the rails. Ryan Braun. 19 out of 25 for the Brew Crew. Brew Crew, where are you, Brew Crew? Brad G with that. All right. There you go. Uh, it's a licensing thing, Evan. It's a licensing thing. Um, where are the... Here are the hits. Those are the These inserts. Are the that's the veteran base, gotcha. Did you see this on our site? That we weren't told about? What? And then look how we spelled our Twitter handle. Get, get that off the site. Let's get that off the website. I forgot that's, to pee. It's garbage. Oh, God. That's just... That's how hard that, is that? It's embarrassing for him. Unbelievable. Oh, we, gotta, we gotta talk to our website. That's why guys. he doesn't do any of our social media. No yeah, he marketing. does zero of our social media or marketing. Why no is his marketing. name on our website? Yeah. I, 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 and if he has, I have not been informed by it, nor have I seen any boost from it. That's on wax, too. This is on a recording, too. <laughs> no, I'm saying, I'm saying it's, it's, I put it on the record. Yeah. Nothing, John 409. This is just this is just uh, idle gossip. Yeah, this is probably the one of the weirdest breaks. Long breaks, longer breaks like this just descend into this kind of mad madness here. So did we did we do a Twitter poll on that chicken thing or is it a little too dark? What? The uh, not the San Diego chicken versus the, the bless green. his soul. Uh, the uh, feeding cannibalism. Oh, the pig law. Yeah. I mean, I'm sure we can Google it. When we have a break, we'll we'll Google it and we'll get an official result on it, folks. If you look at if you if you go to uh, YouTube.com/slash Jaspie's Hobbyland, that goes straight to our YouTube channel. Search our videos only and search hashtag PigLaw, and you'll be able to look at the video and, and see the discussion about PigLaw. That's a teaser. Go for it. Hi, Paige. 
Oh man, you caught two Jigglypuffs? I only have one Jigglypuff. I've not even seen a Snorlax. I did catch a Clefairy today and an Onyx on, the, go on the way to brunch. Pokevision.com. I don't, I don't need cheater stuff like that. I don't need Pokevision.com. Um, I want to be surprised. I don't need to get to like level 30 in two days and then be bored with the game. I'm gonna I'm gonna slow play the game. I'm gonna play Pokemon Go at the pace that I would like to play it at at a man of my age. Team Team Mystic. We work hard. You guys grind. Oh okay. Oh okay. Team Valor. Team Mystic. You know wants to know about the evolution of Pokemon and the knowledge they could bring to us. Through through logic and academic study, you know what I mean? Yeah, as a forty as a forty five year old man, as a fifty year old man, Kisby, I should not really be working that hard. Mistakes, you know. Oh, see, Todd's daughter Paige is Team Valor too. There you go. Oh, oh, oh Arthur, Arthur's Mystic. That's right, Arthur. I we need to come up with yeah, a gang you know symbol for that. I, I'm not surprised a Cowboys fan. Is wow. Oh, 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 oh boy. This this team this break has gone off the rails. Forty six out of one forty nine. Mookie bets for the Red Sox. People are gonna watch this video and be like, "This video is unwatchable." Odubel Herrera, one oh nine out of one forty nine. This looks like a Prism hot box, folks. Philadelphia Phillies with that one. Bunch of Cowboys Raiders fans. What a joke. Adam Wainwright, red thirty out of ninety nine. That's for the Cardinals. It's a Prism hot box, folks. Prism hot box. Buster Posey, refractor blue. 138 out of 149 for the Gigantes. And uh, Jeremy Hazelbaker. That's a great name. Hazelbaker. What happened to Ryan Mountcastle? 271 out of 299 for the Cardinals. Another one for the Cardinals. Nice prism there. It's a prism hot box. Adam Eaton for the White Sox. 29 out of 299. We got Brian Dozier for the Twins, another one for Will, 188 out of 199. Got Matt Kemp, refract 29 out of 50. That's kind of a pale blue border right there. 29 out of 50. Nice one for the Padres. Going out to TJ with the Padres. Oh, that's a refractor right there. I'll send that. Addison Russell with that's three out of twenty-five. Nice. 3 out of 25, Addison Russell. And the autograph is a Cub. Look at that. Kisby. Hey. Nice Kyle Schwarber. Look at that. Bummer that, that guy, this guy was supposed to be like the big baseball name in the hobby right now, but. But injuries. Garrett Cole, blue for the coach, I believe, has the Pirates. 72 out of 149. And Billy Burns right there. Nice. Bunch of parallels and a uh, another auto should be expected. 25 out of 199 for the Detroit Tigers. Tigers hit going out to Sean. And 79 out of 150. Getting some of that Oppo Joe Mojo. These are my rivals, so it's opposite Joe. Oppo Joe Mojo. Mac Williamson. San Francisco Giants for Will Halpy. Mac Williamson actually broke with Nick at the uh, spring training, at the Panini-sponsored spring training event uh, earlier this year. So I guess he's technically a friend of Jaspi's Hobby, and even though he's my rival, Oppo Joe. Adam Jones for the O's, 77 out of 99. Oh, uh, Orioles going to Justin P. Jason Kipnis for the Indians, 123 out of 149. Jorge Soler for Troy, 187 out of 299. And the last bit of this break, folks. Alcides Escobar. 35 out of 149. Jose Altuve for the Astros, 88 out of 199. Jose Fernandez, Diamond Kings insert. Nice. 131 out of 199 for Joe Fair. Miami Marlins going to... What is Miami Marlins? Is? Oh, Marlins Braves combo. That's you, Ashley. Ashley with that one. Nelson Cruz. 162 out of 299 for the Mariners. A couple Diamond Kings cards. There's a Roldis Chapman. Where does he go? Does he get traded? 74 out of 299. Yankees with that one. That's Junior. Refractor. And Power Alley. There's Carlos Gonzalez right there. Power Alley, Albert Pujols. 
70 out of 99. Nice prism hot box. And a nice break, ladies and gentlemen. Only $19.99 to get a random spot in this break, folks. The next one is already on the website, jazbeeshobbyland.com. And it's a fresh case with uh, with hot boxes in there. At least three. I think this was only three hot boxes. Uh, two, two to four hot boxes could possibly be in there. So be sure to check that out at jazbeeshobbyland.com. Now, like I said, we are going to randomize all the... Uh, unless it's an autograph, I guess. But no, you know what? We're going to randomize... Here, I'll, I'll just set it in stone right now. All, all of the San Diego chicken cards will be randomized together as a lot. I'm going to change that on the website right now. So just keep that in mind. Uh, okay, so let's go to random.org because I need to randomize this to somebody. Oh, no worries, John409. You are welcome. You're welcome, Kisby. We do have fun in our breaks. That's the kind of a thing we do. So video is still running, right? Yes. All right, there are the names. Todd and Will, top and bottom. Put the names in here. Let's roll again. Three and a three, six. Six times. Six the hard way. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. Name on top, Junior. There you go. So you get the San Diego Chicken base cards and... This refractor right here too, 178 out of 199, refractor, parallel, prism, blah, blah, blah. There it is, folks. That was another great optic break. Optic break number two from jazbeeshobbyland.com here on the 22nd of July. Thank you very much, folks. Get into the next one. That's from a fresh case, jazbeeshobbyland.com. Thanks. Bye.